Hey guys, this is Aaron from Geeky Lemon Development and welcome to our weekly tutorial. And this week I'll be showing you how to keep your app awake. So already in my project set up, it's a simple view based application for the iPhone and I've simply named it Keeping the App Awake just for the purpose of this tutorial. Now what this is actually going to do is prevent your device from going to standby and then finally locking your device which is a great advantage for apps that require not to touch the screen for a certain amount of time but the disadvantage is it can rapidly decrease the battery life of your device depending on how powerful your application is so all you really need to do now is simply go to your appdelegate.m and what we have here the board application just before the override point here Hit enter a few times and then make a little bit of room. I'll zoom in for you now. And you need to start by typing UI application space asterisk my app, we'll simply call it space equals space bracket UI application again space shared application and now we'll end that with a bracket in a semicolon and hit enter and type in my app dot idle timer displayed do space equals space and do capital ES and hit semicolon so then we can save that and if you want to pause it and catch up on any of that a bit of code that's all that's simply needed to prevent the iPhone from going on standby and if we zoom out now go to build and run Once it's loaded, you'll see nothing really changes in the simulator and I can't really show you on the simulator how it really works because the simulator doesn't really go on standby but if you set up this application and test it on your device and just leave it for a few seconds and you'll notice that your device will not go on standby. So I hope this helps in any of your apps or projects at the moment. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you all next week in the next tutorial. Make sure you favour and like the video so you have it for future reference. Also check out the full source code for this tutorial and all our others on our website at geekelement.com. Send us a message or leave us a comment if you want to suggest any tutorials yourself or if you just want to leave us some feedback. And follow and like us on Facebook and Twitter. All the links will be in the description below as well as a full list of all our apps which are currently on the App Store. Make sure you go check them out and most importantly if you haven't Make sure you subscribe.